guys, today I'm going to do a reveal on a bag that I just got yesterday. I purchased this pre-owned from a reseller on um, my Facebook group that I'm in and it's from the LV Louis Vuitton Ritzy Addicted 1 and 2 and um, A Place for Expensive Taste. Those are all resale group or Facebook groups that I purchased from and the reseller that I bought this bag from is Bag District Authentic Matters and they are um, from a resale company from Thailand and the customer service was exceptional. The bag came in um, as described. I got like 30 detailed pictures before I purchased it. The shipping was incredibly fast. You pay one price. You don't have any extra duties or fees or taxes. It came DHL Express shipping, signature required. I bought it on a Friday. I received it on a Wednesday, so that's insanely fast. And I mean, I can't say enough good things about this. And I got in a great price too. The prices are exceptional. So if you're looking to buy a pre-owned bag, and sometimes you can even tell them what you're looking for and they can try to find it for you. And so if you're looking to buy a pre-owned Louis Vuitton bag, I highly recommend this company. I'll link their Facebook page down below so that you can check out what they have and message them and maybe they can help you. But the bag that I'm talking about is the Louis Vuitton Palos MM in the monogram print. And the this berry color, which is called Aurora. Aurora, Aurora, I don't know. But it's more of like a wine berry color and it's super gorgeous. This bag retails currently for $2,760. Ooh, and after taxes, $2,900. So <laughs> that is quite a lot. I did not pay that. This bag was brand new. They said that it has never been used and I can seriously vouch for that. This bag has absolutely no wear on it. It does have the uh, handle ring, but this was made from 2000, 2013 and so from storage that has happened, hopefully over time that'll go away. Um, but as far as wear and tear, this bag was absolutely brand new and I paid 1550 that's it. So I got this bag, basically brand new, for half off. To get a Louis Vuitton bag half off is an amazing, amazing deal. And the quality and craftsmanship of this bag is on point. The stitching is perfection. It's just absolutely gorgeous. The details are stunning. The hardware is amazing. Everything says Louis Vuitton. It all matches. It's thick. It's durable. These zipper pulls are just, it's beautiful. This is a beautifully crafted handbag. I feel amazing carrying it but this is one of their higher priced bags. So um, I'm thinking these lower priced canvas bags like the Speedies, the Neverfulls, are being mass produced, slopped together. They don't have the details like their higher priced bags. This one has the microfiber lining, which is absolutely stunning. It's got two magnetic pockets on both sides. It's got the zipper with two poles. It's got organization on the inside, organization on the outside, a removable strap, handles, Feet on the bottom, very underrated bag. This is, in my opinion, so much better of an option than a Speedy. I know the price point is like double, but if you can buy this pre-owned, they, they don't hold the resale value of these bags. So you can get them pre-owned for the price of a brand new Speedy bandolier. So I would seriously consider getting one of these over a Speedy, because I think in the long run, this is just gonna hold up so much better. I think that you're gonna be happy with the organization. The Speedy is just so not organized. Like there's no organization for you, for you unless you get an organizer in there and then it takes up space and the opening isn't as nice. So, and this is a soft canvas like a Speedy, but it also feels thick, but this is from 2013. So this is kind of before the quality went downhill. <laughs> um, but we have the two straps and then the handle and the, the pockets, which I plan on slipping my cell phone in there. Um, the inside, and the, the whole bag has that microfiber lining on the inside. I have my stuff in it, I'm gonna use it today. This was made in 2013 from France, made in France. And it's got this gorgeous buried microfiber lining in there. It's got two slip pockets on one wall and then one big slip pocket on the other wall. The two outside magnetic. I mean, guys, I can't rave about this bag enough. It is, it is such good, a good bag. And I think it's underrated and I don't know why. I think it's because of the price point, but I agree, I wouldn't pay almost $3,000, but 
I would pay the price of a Speedy for this, and you can get them pre on So look for your Plus and then They also have this, the Plus BB, which is smaller, and that one's really, really popular. Um, so yeah, guys, love it. And the company that I purchased from, I can't recommend them enough. It did come with the drawstring dust bag, which is really nice. It came with the original brown booklet because the packaging was brown back then and the original uh, little tag that says coated fabric outside calf, calf leather trimming and man-made lining. So it came with all of that. And I mean, guys, how beautiful is this bag? I'm so excited. And the patina, it has like no patina, so I'm going to be able to watch it darken. I have it on the shortest strap setting right now. It's got one, two, three, four, five strap settings. So I'm gonna do a quick mod shot. Today I'm just wearing some jean shorts and a black top from Michael Kors, which I actually got at the Michael Kors outlet and it was only like, $30 and it's really nice quality fabric so here is the bag top handle love this love the drop on the handles it just fits so comfortably under the arm then the handles drop down and it goes so nice on the shoulder guys look how cute is this bag so comfortable love it So excited. I love these big giant rings on the side because the, the strap lays so nice. You can hand hold it. It's not too big. It's not too small. I think it's a perfect medium sized bag. So, see that berry color? See the glazing? It's so fresh, so brand new. Got the feet. This canvas is squishy but thick at the same time. Yeah. So I'm telling you guys, don't sleep on the Plus MM. I don't know why it's not more popular. It's, I think it's the price point, and people just don't think that you can get them cheaper than that. But you really, really can. So if you have any questions, of course, leave a comment down below. And until next time. Bye, guys.